Hello, my name is Elise, and I've been channeling star beings for quite some time, and I've been keeping it kind of behind closed doors given I know it's charged for a lot of people, but they have been on me for quite some time now to get this out there. So I am now ready. I know that people, will, it will be charged for some people. There'll be some judgment, those projections, all those things that happen with humans. It's part of the human condition. My only recommendation is to say this, is unless you've had the experience, you don't know. So it's not in our best interest to judge other people based on their experiences, because unless you've had the experience, you don't know. And this is my world. I live it every day. I, they talk to me on a constant basis. <laughs> so I'm just going to put this out there and see what happens. And they've been asking me, like I said, for quite some time. So here's something back in January of 23. And I call them the council. They call themselves something else. I'm going to stick with the council because, again, I think a lot of this stuff gets charged with people. And I have seen them. I know what they look like. I can feel them in my body when they come in. I'm not afraid of them. I work with them on a regular basis. I know my physical being, my physical body has changed given my work with them. So I just want to put that out there. So here's one of their channels. I say, who are you? And they say, Elise, we welcome you to this council. And I will say right now, when that happened, whoosh, I was taken right up to them. And I saw, I walked into this room and I saw all these different energies and beings sitting at a table. So I'm just gonna say that. And then they go on to say, we will share new information concerning your DNA for the masses of the human race and consciousness. There are many changes happening on your planet at this moment. We are here to assist from the many races of the galaxy. We ask for your assistance on this council as we channel through you so you may take this information out into your world to assist your human race. We are so thankful you are willing to work with us and channel our messages so we may help evolve the human race and all the races among the galaxy. It is time for humanity to step up to a different frequency of light in order to help assist the greater good. Then they go on to say, we are here to speak through release for the greater good of humanity. We bring awareness to the realms that most humans do not perceive exist. We come from the 12th frequency or however you decide to perceive that as a dimension or a frequency or space. We come through a portal connected with the ground dwellers the ancient ones, that's what I call them, that are now speaking through release through their own star language and their star language transfers over to the galactic star language, their star races in the sky or the stars, however you want, in the cosmos, however you want to perceive that. And then they go on to say, we came down to help the first humans navigate this early plane and to conceive different perspectives on how to evolve in humanity as a whole. The microbial DNA is a source within your DNA that comes from more of a natural source. The waters of evolution in sync with the polymers function on a quantum level shift. The evolution of humanity to open up doorways within your DNA that have been dormant for centuries, or you could perceive more as eons. Now, as they're talking about this, I'm going, wait a minute, I don't know what microbial DNA is. I had to go look it up. I have a background in anatomy and phys and all the all those wonderful things biology but again it's been a while I had to go look it up right so it's in our DNA it's in our RNA it's more malleable those kinds of things so now it's, it started to make sense to me right as you don't believe that humans have been here for very long we would counter that as we have worked with humans which is a concept in your sciences that does not believe that we exist, that humans existed beyond 200,000 years ago, which they do or have. So you can take that for whatever you need to. I've seen it, I can feel it. I just think that, you know, we're just now, get, we're just like hitting like this tiny little surface of who we really are and things are coming up in the earth and we're being shown them we're on this evolutionary process where it's just oh my gosh all this stuff's just going to come in it's just it's, it's already happening it's amazing so those are a few thoughts for you to ponder okay thanks for listening and i will see you next time